Yes, we're back. We're back again in Omsi 2. We're back again in Bodenham. And this time we've moved on another chrono. We're on to F. And as you can see, we're going all bendy. We're going to do the park and ride route from here at the park and ride. And I'm already panicking about getting this thing round at roundabout. Uh, back to the bus station, the year 1995. The bus, it's a bendy one. Grab that guidebook to all things bendy. And let's go. So yes, hi there, Steve here, and welcome back to OMSI 2. If you're new to my videos, welcome indeed. OMSI going out on the channel every single Monday. On a Wednesday, we have something from trains. On a Friday, something from firm bus. On a Saturday, will either be something from flight, something from tourist bus, or something single player. And occasionally on a Sunday, we have something random. So plenty of content from me. Please do hit subscribe if you haven't done already. So yes, working our way through the chrono events now. Uh, chrono events, if you're new to them, come part of uh, Bodenham um, and basically advances years and gives you different parts of the map. The map changes, the buses change, uh, we get new routes and as you can see there, a new McDonald's has appeared and a new KFC. And the park and ride is new, uh, which is why we're doing this. Uh, we've gone through uh, every chrono so far, picked a different route and a different bus, which is what I will continue to do. So the year I've picked then, 1995 for this one, because Chrono F runs between 94 and 98. And we are doing this at Route 400. Apsley Park and Ride to Apsley Bus Station via Hampton Row. Um, so it's a new park and ride route operated daily by SYT. Um, now, I won't link in the description below where you can pick up Bodenham. I say just in case it changes uh, by the time you're watching this as to where you can get it from. Um, so jump in the Discord server, which I will link below. Uh, and there we've got it pinned um, so you can get the latest version. Uh, right, let's um, get ourselves back inside then. Power this thing up. So we're due out in two minutes. So I haven't set anything up yet. So again, you can see how... That's a noise. How we uh, go from cold and dark in a bus. Uh, so pick our route. So we are on uh, line uh, 400. If I can find it. There it is, right at the top. Uh, line 400, so circulation 201. Park and ride uh, to the bus station. So it's only a short route. Uh, so 12 minutes long and we've got about a minute or so uh, to get ourselves set up uh, so that's done and uh, then we probably won't be able to uh, do it in the bus here uh, line 400 enter route 2 route 1 okay then that's a thing that's not going to happen then um, so uh, let's uh, do the front of the bus anyway. Oh, we've got a bus behind us by the looks of things. So line 400. Um, let's see if we can find it in here. Hopefully it does appear because we are running out of time to uh, be able to uh, get around and pick up our passengers. Shout if you see it. That's not really a lot of use really, is it? 400 park on right. There we go. Absolutely park and ride. Okay, so there we are. So bus is set up. Uh, we will pop the map on. And we can get rid of that now. So we are pretty much on time. Let's um make our way round. And a bendy bus around this roundabout. Yeah, that's going to be interesting for sure. And we do it with these. So he's not in service. Okay, so on our passengers get. Good morning. We'll put the arrows on. Good morning, mate. How are you doing? Hey, 
here, driver. Hello. So a capacity of 59 people. There's quite a few uh, waiting. Don't think it's quite going to be 59. Good morning. All right. Good morning. Hi, Hello. Hello, mate. Hello. Morning. Good morning. Good morning, sweetie. Good morning. All right, there we go. Last of them on. So uh, we have got the bendy bit back there. We are now running slightly late. So. And yes, the. Uh, we've got the buggy button situation, haven't we? Um, which one? That one. There we go. It should be good to go now. There we go. So the buggy button stops those rear doors from closing, basically. In case someone's getting on with uh, uh, a buggy. So the park and ride is this way. So it's only a short route. But I'm really, really enjoying uh, Bodenham. Uh, it is uh, up there with my favourite maps. Uh, fantastic and free, obviously. So I do recommend checking out not only this Discord server, because it is an awesome community, uh, but then do check out uh, Bodenham as well. And uh, let me know below, what's your favourite route? Uh, do you do the same as I'm doing in um, going through the correct route in the correct bus in the correct livery? Uh, so the SYT. Is that something that you enjoy doing with Bodenham? Uh, let me know below. And if you're in the Discord, uh, post some screenshots. Okay, so you went from being a minute or so late to now eight minutes early. That's a thing, it happened. Yeah, really do like the uh, the variety. It's going to be interesting as we get uh, other vehicles um, available in uh, in Bodenham as we're increasing the years. So I do intend uh, on carrying on. I will um, go through every Chrono event because we've got some really interesting buses coming up, and I'm going to try, if if at all possible, uh, not to uh, repeat routes either. Which may become more difficult towards the end. You're not getting on, are you? Volkswagen crept by there. And don't forget as well, if you've got a uh, bus company simulator, we have got a Sims and stuff uh, bus company as well. Uh, always looking for new drivers. Something that we are currently streaming uh, over on Twitch once a week. So check out uh, the Twitch page. If I remember, I will, of course, leave a link to that in the description below also. I love the noise this thing makes. Oh, I should have stopped there, shouldn't I? Oh, well, I don't think anybody's getting on anyway. We'll stop down here. That'll be fine. Oh, you have footsteps. So someone's getting off at Brownie Halls. I just love the little bits of detail in this. I've got um, traffic noise turned off uh, because of the uh, sirens. So 
So rear doors open. People get off. Probably the ones that wanted to get off at the stop before, but that's yeah, fine. And then the rear doors close automatically. And make our way off towards uh, Frederick Street. Yeah, I've always liked Bodenham. Uh, a few years ago, I went through and did um, some routes as well, uh, going through a lot of these. So go and check that out. It's really uh, scary audio and me being very, very nervous. Uh, my first few uh, videos on YouTube. It was a long time ago. Uh oh, okay, so we've got to get a bendy bus around the corner now. That's going to go well. I love that creaking sound. Actually, it did go well. Hampton Row. I think someone's getting off. Okay, onwards. I love the variety of routes. There's some really long routes in Bodenham. But there's also little ones like this. If you just want to jump on and do a short route. You know, this is, what, 12 minutes? And one of those that, uh, although I've never been able to do that in any map, um, you can remember the route, so you don't need the maps on. Again, I'd be interested to know. Uh, let me know uh, below can you drive routes in uh, OMSI without using the maps and the uh, overhead arrows? Do you remember the routes? Do you know where all the bus stops are? There's a few people in the Discord community that pretty much only play OMSI. Um, which I just find completely bewildering. I enjoy it, but I just I don't know if I could just only... Spend my time in this. Wow, you got off and disappeared. All the nags head coming up, which, uh, as I uh, record this, the day before it goes live, yep, I've run out of pre-recorded content, uh, pubs now open again in the UK. It is odd with Bodum. It's obviously a UK-based map, but we're driving on the right. <laughs> and that car's got a British registration. Um... But it's the wrong colour. So it should be a uh, yellow number plate. But you know, it's a free map. We shouldn't complain too much. Apparently someone's working on a left path version of Bodenham. I don't know. If, <clears throat> excuse me. Don't know if that will take the sort of, sort of thing away from it, really. Oh, no one's getting off here, are they? So we don't need to stop. Oh, we're nearly there already. Oh. Well, definitely a uh, shorter video for this week then. <laughs> but do recommend checking out the uh, Twitch streams. The occasional one I do manage to put out on YouTube. Uh, but sometimes, depending on who's driving in multiplayer, when we do the uh, the streams... It, the language can get a bit um, interesting and the topic of conversation as normally happens on some of my uh, streams uh, can get a bit random so they don't always make it onto YouTube so I do recommend checking out the live content uh, so I will if I remember anyway uh, put the link to that in the description below so uh, yeah really really well worth uh, checking out eventually we'll be just streaming at the weekends but currently streaming during the week uh, as well here we are then stand three So this changes over time. You can see we had the painted bit of uh, uh, road as you came in. Um, I love the fact how Bodenham uh, evolves um, over time. It's just fantastic. I wish there were more maps that did that. 
um, did the Corona event. So it ended up being um, 1 minute 40 early. I was trying any other stops. I don't think I should have actually stopped at any of those stops. No one got on, but it did say that people wanted to get off. So that was the thing. Oh, there we are. Uh, 400 then. Uh, absolute park and ride is uh, done. And yeah, really, really enjoying um, OMSI. Uh, the bus station, I say, it just... I don't, it just looks so nice. Um, I love the fact that you know these these all change and so that bit of road as you come in uh is painted uh, to be a bus lane that wasn't originally um and the fact that we got some really interesting stuff coming up uh on some of the corona events i don't know which one i'm going to do next time so this is one we've just done is f um g uh, a number of Apsi residents complained about the complexity of the bus network to reduce confusion the route network is simplified a new bus stop at monkton village is added so um g um, is going to be interesting, including that, I think, comes in. Yeah, man UEL. So perhaps we can try that next time, uh, which is a coach bus thing on the X2. So we might do the X2 next time. Uh, and then we've got H to go. Um, and then uh, uh, I. So that takes up to 2005, uh, including that weird little thing. We're definitely going to drive that. Uh, J takes us to 2008. Um, back in a double decker. Uh, K, uh, where was K? K takes us to 2012. Uh, more modern uh, bendies, we'll certainly do that. Uh, L uh, takes us to, uh, still in 2012, when we get to L, uh, more double deckers there. Uh, M uh, brings uh, more modern Citaro. Uh, M is uh, up to 2013, so we're getting towards the end. N, um, brings in the coach uh, the volvo where you've got to do a breath test before you drive it um o is 2014 um more more modern ish double deckers in that one and that's it o is the final one so we have got a few more routes to do a few more videos to do we'll certainly uh, bring some in that are longer um so let me know below if you're enjoying the content um and um yeah certainly going to be carrying on with it uh, let's have a look and see how we scored though we'll terminate the tour before we finish so one bus stop while on time punctuality was a hundred percent zero crashes and i didn't hurt any pedestrians always a winner drove 3.1k didn't sell any tickets because i haven't got ticketing on mainly and passenger satisfaction 80 92 percent so there we go um we can actually go back in and drive the next tour if we wanted to um so there we are so we could do the return journey it's that simple i do love uh, playing in single player through bus company simulator um again a great addition to um omzi even if you're not planning on joining a bus company really because it does give you the map it does give you this information at the top telling you whether you're ahead or behind on time um it lets you uh, which are shown in other videos um basically choose the map you want and choose the bus you want so you can use any bus on any map easily. Um, and the way of doing it at the beginning is so much simpler. Um, but yeah, really, really well worth picking up Bus Company Sim, even if you're not in a bus company. Although I can recommend joining ours. So there we go. We will end that there. Next time then, back possibly with the X2, if I remember. Um, but do check out my other content as well. Trains on a Wednesday, firm bus on a Friday. Uh, something either single player tourist bus or flight on a saturday and the occasional random sunday as well so plenty of content from me and do please check out that discord server until the next time then if you have been thanks very very much for watching <laughs>